Hello, I'm Kathy, on behalf of Yangu, the official youth constituency of UNFCCC. We appreciate this opportunity to these climate change dialogues. Young people around the world are actively participating in global action to halt climate change. We're here today to advocate for the rights of young and future generations. And we ask you to please consider us in your crucial multilateral decision-making processes. We continue to persuade these efforts in spite of the challenges presented by COVID-19 by continuing to draw on our diverse perspectives, expertise, and innovative solutions to enhance youth engagement and leadership on climate action and strategy. Last year in Madrid, Younger was delighted to work with the COP25 presidency, progressive governments, UNICEF, and the Children's Environmental Rights Initiative to launch the first ever intergovernmental declaration on children, youth, and climate action based on priorities and messages of children and young people around the world. The declaration signed by 12 governments so far sets out a comprehensive set of commitments for accelerating inclusive, child and youth-centered climate policies and action at national and global levels. We call in all states' parties to align with and implement the declaration's critical commitments in order to fulfill children and young people's right to a safe and healthy planet. We appreciate the recent regional AG ACE dialogues and wish to remind all parties and stakeholders of the critical importance to adopt a new and enhanced work program on ACE at COP26, as education, training, and public engagement are vital pillars for achieving the objectives of the Paris Agreement. In this crisis, those with the least responsibility will bear the heaviest burdens. You hold the power to change the course of history by amplifying the voice of science, abandoning business as usual, and taking a stand for the planet and for the generations to come. And you have our support. In closing, we wish to thank the UNFCCC for their support of the young and future generations. Thank you.